Morning everyone, welcome to another video by Upgrade or Trash IT, the video channel where I look at seeing how useful older laptops can still be. In this video I've got the Latitude 3350 and I'm going to be installing Windows 10 on it. Now I have just created a video where I've installed Windows 10 on this laptop when it had a hard disk drive in it. But what I've done is I've swapped the hard disk drive out for an SSD drive and we're going to see how much more quickly it installs on an SSD drive than a hard disk drive. So let me turn it on. Get it to boot to the flash disk here. And off we go. And we've got this really scratchy screen. I've already explained this in the other video. This happens, seems to happen on quite a lot of Dell laptops. It sorts itself out within a few minutes, so don't worry too much about it. Okay, the language, time and currency and keyboard options are there. They're all set to the UK because that's where I'm located. Let's quickly do the Microsoft Terms and Conditions. Okay, I want to install, fresh install. I am going to delete all of these partitions, so I'll just pause it. Okay, so I've deleted all of those partitions and now I've just got one big lot of unallocated space where I want to install Windows 10 on. So this is the part where the files on the USB stick are transferred over to the laptop. Let me explain a little bit about this Latitude 3350. It was originally launched in the UK in December 2016. It's got an i5 fifth generation processor in it. It's got eight gigabytes of RAM. It's, I've just put in a 128 gigabyte uh, solid state drive. It has got a 13.3 inch touch screen and it was originally shipped with Windows 10 Pro. So you can see that we're about 15% through. So I'm just gonna pause this to um, save your sanity and we'll come back when it's in the high 90s. Okay, so the file swap is completed and we're just about to do our first restart. So there we go. I bought this laptop on eBay in the UK for about 90 pounds. And I've checked on eBay in the US and you can get them from anywhere between about $80 to $115, depending on the specific spec. The laptop itself is in really great condition. I mean, there's hardly a scratch on it. If you don't mind plastic, then it looks very stylish. It has got a couple of USB ports on it. It's got an HDMI port on it. It's got an Ethernet port, it's got an SD card port, it's got an audio jack, and as I've said already, the touch the screen is touch. So it's got the promise to be quite a nifty little laptop. 
and of course you can see that it has a built-in webcam. I would expect on an SSD drive for Windows 10 to install in about 20 minutes. That's what's happened on other Dell laptops where I've put an SSD drive in. Whereas an installation time with a traditional hard disk drive can take anywhere between, between 30 and 40 minutes. So at the moment we're on about 10 minutes. So here we go, we're going into our second restart as part of the installation process.
Okay, so it's time to select the region. UK is correct. And same for the keyboard. I don't want an additional keyboard layout. Okay, so this is connected to my Wi-Fi, so I'll just pause this. Okay, so I've connected to the Wi-Fi successfully. Okay, so I'm going to set this up for personal use. And I'm just going to put my account in, so I'm just going to pause this again. So I've added my Microsoft account and I've created a pin. So everything's gone smoothly there. And in terms of install time, we are on about 18 minutes. Okay, so this is the part where we get to decide how much data we want to share. So I'm going to do no to most of it. I'm going to skip this about customizing the laptop to use for the various things. I don't want to connect it to my Android phone. Neither do I want to connect to OneDrive at the moment. Okay, I don't want a trial of Microsoft 365. Neither do I want a game pass. I don't want to set their voice assistant Cortana up. So it looks like we're in the home straight.
So there we go. Windows 10 has been installed, successfully installed on the Dell Latitude 3350 with eight gigabytes of RAM and an SSD installed. And the total time is just over 20 minutes. And that is about 10 minutes quicker than Windows 10 installs on the same laptop, but with a hard disk drive installed. Thanks for watching.